News coming in right now. 1984 riots accused Jagdish Taitler has been made a member of the Pradesh Election Committee for the Municipal Corporation of Delhi elections by the Congress. Those polls are to happen on the 4th of December. Now news coming in that he has been made a member. Jagdish Taitler who is accused in the 1984 riots case, he has been made a member of the Pradesh Election Committee for the Municipal Corporation of Delhi elections. The Congress party has made him a member of that committee, which is the poll panel that the Congress has formed ahead of the very crucial MCD elections on December 4th. There's a row that's brewing now over the choice of the Congress party to include Jagdish Taitler into its poll panel, its very significant poll panel ahead of the MCD elections. Let's listen in to reactions that are already coming in. <laughs> जो सबसे बड़ा सिखों का कातल है कितने हजारों बेगुनाह लोगों को मारने वाले लोगों को भी कांग्रेस ने आज फिर से अपनी चुनाव समिति का मेंबर के रूप में एक उसको दर्जा देकर ये स्थापित किया है कि कांग्रेस और गांधी परिवार कातलों से कभी दूर नहीं रह सकते क्योंकि 1984 के कातलों को अपने साथ रखने का एक ही बड़ा कारण है क इन लोगों को अपने से दूर किया तो ये हमारे राज खोल देंगे हमारे खिलाफ खड़े हो जाएंगे और सिखों से इतनी नफरत सिखों से इतना दूरी सिखों के प्रति सिखों के कातलों से इतना प्यार ये दर्शाता है कांग्रेस की मानसिकता नहीं बदली वो सिखों की कातल जमात 1984 में थी लेकिन अपने मन से और सोच से आज वो सिखों की कातल ही है So that is, of course, uh, the BJP's Manjinder Singh Sirsa. They're attacking the Congress party for, in fact, including a member into their committee who, in fact, stands accused of the 1984 anti-Sikh riots. Uh, the BJP, they're upping the ante against the Congress party. The Congress party has included Jagdish Taitler into their poll panel, a committee that they formed ahead of the MCD elections. Remember, it will be a very hotly contested election with the BJP and the Aam Aadmi Party, of course, leading that contest. But the Congress, of course, will also be contesting that election. And now, with the Congress uh, preparing itself for that election, forming a poll panel, the inclusion of Jagdish Taitler into that significant poll panel has, in fact, raised a lot of uh, eyebrows. The BJP, they're attacking the Congress party for, in fact, including Jagdish Taitler into that poll panel saying that the Gandhis and the top leadership of the Congress party are quite wary of sidelining Jagdish Taitler lest he disclose who indeed was behind the 1984 anti-Sikh riots and how the administration was hand in glove. Rahul Gautam is joining me over the phone line right now. The Congress over there, Rahul, drawing a lot of flack from its political opponents for the inclusion of Jagdish Taitler into that very crucial poll panel that they formed for the MCD elections. Absolutely, you know, the very inclusion of uh, uh, Mr. Taitler uh, in this important election committee that has been formed by uh, Delhi Congress uh, Pradesh Committee has actually drawn a lot of flack. And in fact, it is also getting a lot of heat, uh, you know, from the BJP because BJP is alleging that uh, this is nothing uh, but only uh, insulting uh, the sentiments of uh, 1984 anti-Sikh rights, given the fact that uh, Mr. Teitler uh, was accused of being involved uh, in that uh, particular uh, incident. And therefore, the, the Congress party is at the receiving end. We also must understand that um, uh, Mr. Teitler, we all know, um, has been a very veteran uh, leader of, the, of Delhi Congress, has been part of many election committees earlier as well. But this time around, his, uh, uh, you know, his, uh, his inclusion, his induction in this important election committee is only uh, becoming an apt opportunity for BJP at a time when MCD elections are around the corner. So it seems that uh, it is certainly going to be a huge, uh, you know, uh, a setback for the Congress party and it seems that they might also cost uh, in terms of votes in coming days given the fact that uh, the national capital has, uh, you know, uh, a considerable size of population as far as Sikh and Punjabi communities concerned. 
Right. Rahul, also not the first time that the Congress has made similar moves despite knowing what the sentiment on the ground is, despite knowing that it could politically or electorally backfire for them. So what exactly is the thinking behind including Jagdish Taitler? Well, so far there hasn't been any justification uh, on the part of the Delhi uh, Congress Pradesh Committee, uh, but we're still trying to get a word from them. But uh, what sources are indicating to us that uh, 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 Mr. Teichler has always been part of various election committees post-94, and uh, so therefore it's a mere, uh, you know, routine decision that has been taken by the uh, by the high command here in the national capital. But uh, uh, obviously, you rightly pointed out that uh, since this decision it seems to be backfiring, we expect that uh, the Congress might go on uh, some course correction and they might drop him in coming days if pressure mounts upon Congress party. Uh, you know, for Mr. Dagish Tyler, they might re retreat from this decision and might drop Mr. Tyler uh, from this important election committee. But one thing is very important here, I was telling you earlier also, there are a large number of Sikhs in Punjabi uh, who uh, reside in the national capital, and if Congress party is not going to, you know, cause correction, uh, you know, uh, do or rectify the decision, it mm -hmm. might uh, backfire them electorally. Right. Rahul, thank you so much for joining us over the phone line.